Welcome bosses. In this video, I am proud to share with you our latest feature, custom domains, something that thousands of you have asked for and now it is live. Simply scroll to your dashboard and go to your account settings and you will now see you have custom domain over here. Click expand and you will see there's some instructions here. The first thing you're going to want to do is choose your domain name. So it could be uh, www yourname.com um, or it could be something like book me which I'm going to do over here but you'll see now over here it says example.com and it's very important that we point whatever name you choose to domains.bookme.name and there's an article here you could click on that'll show you exactly how to do that but I'm going to walk you through it so I'm going to for this uh, case study I'm going to show you bookme.pyramid.com now make sure you click save. Your custom domain was updated successfully. First of all, you'll see here that still your personal URL is bookme.name.slash-montoya in this example. Um, but you'll see now it says bookme.pyramid.com. So now you want to log in to your GoDaddy account or whatever wherever you're hosting your domain. And you'll see DNS management for pyramid.com. Now I already created the C name, so you can see here the book me. And again, this name has to match uh, exactly what you put over here. So, but uh, and then you have appointed domains dot book me dot name, which is very important. But I'll show you how to do it. If you just want to add it, just click add. And here you're going to click C name. And again, you can put in book me or whatever you want, www, whatever you want that subdomain to be. And again, make sure you point it to domains dot book me dot name. I'm not going to save it because I already did it. But we'll go back and now we could test it. And success, your domain connection should be live within 24 hours, usually faster if you never had that subdomain before. Uh, and now, when you go, first of all, I'm going to refresh this page so you'll see that your personal URL is now this. We're going to view your page. And you can see that bookme.pyramid is now this page. I'm going to show you um, how to do it in cPanel as well. Simply log into your cPanel account, click Simple DNS Zone Editor. We're going to uh, uh, pick a domain name. In my case, I'm going to do nachum.co. Now, I already set this up, uh, but you're going to, over here, you're going to put in the CNAME record. So over here, you would put book, or let's say I'll put book me now, because I already have, as you can see here, book, and then the CNAME, which again would be, you know, domains, the book me. Dot name, but I'm not going to save it because I already did book at Nahum. Um So let's go, and now you'll see that book.nachum.co is my book me page. Uh, just show you one more thing, and that is that if you wish to disconnect, you could just click disconnect, and you can start again for fresh. Anyway, many more features still to come, and let us know what you think.